We only made it to 61 in Grand Rapids, 64 from Muskegon, 62 Holland and Kalamazoo. After starting out the day in the lower 40s, even some 30s in our northern counties, but everyone will likely wake up to 30s by tomorrow morning. So tonight we are all falling at least into the middle 30s, upper 30s along the lakeshore and lower 30s possible in the interior county. So that could potentially be into Ionia, Montcalm, Macosta, Nuego counties. That's where the coldest air and the coldest temperatures are expected to be by tomorrow morning. And that's where that freeze potential is. There's only a freeze warning in effect for Macosta and Nuego counties, but even into the lower outlying areas of Montcalm and also Ionia, we could see those freezing temperatures for tomorrow morning, but our high temperatures with nothing but sunshine, really not even a cloud in the sky expected tomorrow will make it towards 62 degrees. So here's that frost advisory again for the light blue counties. That's basically for everyone outside of the freeze warning, which is in effect for Nuego and Macosta. All of these until tomorrow morning at nine. So if you're still up with us and you have plants that you don't want to lose, go cover them or bring them inside. High pressure bringing us the cold air from Canada. Now, it's going to keep a lot of the smoke that we've been seeing the past week out of West Michigan, but that will actually start to make its way back into the area late Sunday and for the majority of next week. So we will start to see that haze returning as a result of the smoke from the California and also the West Coast wildfires. Nothing but sunshine through Wednesday with our temperatures getting towards 77 by then.